Well, hi everyone. This is meteorologist Terry Swales. A pretty good sized storm system rolling through the upper Midwest is causing a lot of weather variety. Some spots seeing strong thunderstorms. Some areas out in the western Dakotas experiencing more than two feet of snow. And this weather system will be in the area now as we go through Saturday and Sunday. And what we expect to see around here initially is some scattered showers and thunderstorms, but those look widely scattered tonight. There's better chances on Saturday as the actual cold front continues to move east around the low pressure that'll be heading up into southeastern South Dakota. So during the day on Saturday, I expect to see some clouds scattered about here and from time to time some showers and thunderstorms. These are going to be most numerous during the afternoon hours Saturday as our front starts to pivot across eastern Iowa and western Illinois. Finally, by 6 o'clock in the evening Saturday, it looks like the cold front should cross the river and head off into central Illinois, and that will end the threat of any rain. But behind the system, cold west and northwest winds will begin to blow Saturday night. And by the time we get to Sunday, it looks like clouds will be back in the forecast, and there's a pretty good chance the temperatures will not get out of the low to mid 50s for high. So substantially cooler conditions expected on Sunday after a decent day on Saturday in terms of temperatures with our highs in the 70s before the cool front arrives. So the forecast for Saturday does look this way, variable cloudiness, and from time to time, some occasional showers and thunderstorms. The temperature should reach 74, but it will turn cooler later on the day as winds switch from the south to the southwest at 10 to 20 miles an hour and blowing the cooler air across eastern Iowa and western Illinois.